Truck drivers have taken aim at Aldi in a nationwide protest for increased pay and safety conditions. They claim the grocery giant is refusing to come to the negotiation table, but Aldi disagrees. Scott Beveridge reports. Shoppers at Aldi Tingalpa were confused this morning as to what all the noise was about. What's outrageous? Aldi's wages! What's outrageous? Aldi's wages! Contract truckies say wages are so low they can't pay their bills and mortgages. You know our, our average wage on the industry in the awards about $19 an hour to $20 an hour, so it's very sad. They say it's not just the rate of pay, it's the pressure to drive long hours, skip breaks and compromise safety to meet unrealistic deadlines. What do we want? Safe rates. When do we want it? Now. It's all being cost driven, price driven and money's not everything. Safety and road safety is the predominant issue. They say that in contrast, Woolies and Coles are now doing the right thing by their delivery drivers. They nut out problems and when we point out errors in their supply chain, they're quick to act and enforce it. Aldi says the Transport Workers Union has not provided any direct evidence to support its claims. It says it's conducted its own anonymous survey of drivers finding no safety concerns. But the union says Aldi won't negotiate and cites a 7% spike in road deaths involving trucks in the last year as a prime reason to talk. Why would you still want drivers having to do 14, 15, 16 hours a day to make a living, you know, and risking people's lives? Scott Beveridge, 10 Eyewitness News.